Labrador Retrievers fetch, Border Collies herd, Huskies howl, it's conventional wisdom that many dog breeds act in certain ways because they've been bred to do so over the course of many generations. But a new study to be published Friday in the journal Science finds that though some dog behaviors are indeed associated with particular breeds, breed plays less of a role overall than that conventional wisdom holds. We found things like German short-haired pointers were slightly more likely to point. Researchers surveyed the owners of more than 18 000 dogs and analyzed the DNA of about 2, 100 animals to see if physical traits and behaviors can be correlated with dog breeds. Overall, the study found that about 9% of the variation in an individual dog's behavior can be explained by its breed. Border Collies, for instance, were more likely to be responsive to human direction, a trait called biddability. Owners of beagles, bloodhounds, coonhounds and Siberian huskies will not be surprised to learn that those breeds had a tendency to howl. The same was true of mixed breed dogs, the researchers found, the higher the percentage of border collie in a mutt, the more responsive it was to human commands. From a genetic standpoint, that's fantastic. That means there are real behavioral differences that are connected to breeds that we can go and study, says Eleanor Carlson, a professor at UMass Chan Medical School and another author of the study. Across individual dogs of the same breed, the researchers found huge variations in behavior. For instance, although golden retrievers are, on the whole, more likely to fetch than many other dogs, there are plenty of lazy goldens that sit and watch as their owners fruitlessly toss tennis balls. And no behavior is unique to any single breed, the researchers said. German short-haired pointers are not the only dogs that point. Genetics matter, but genetics are a nudge in a given direction. They're not a destiny, Evan McLean, the director of the Arizona Canine Cognition Center at the University of Arizona, who was not involved in the research, tells NPR.